The road leading to the field where the rally is held passes through a black neighborhood. In fact, a black family lives just across from the field. At least one black stood outside the gate taking pictures. Did he try to get in? Well, they won't let you in. Did you ask permission? No. Say this private property. Are you here as an individual? Or? This, this is a white order. This is private property. All right? He would not be allowed in. No, he's not. There also was a ban on alcoholic beverages. And you didn't let that pickup truck in because they were drinking beer, you say? They, they got in, but we're going to tell them the, the beer is going to have to go or they're going to have to go either one. There are about as many branches of the Ku Klux Klan as there are church denominations. The rally tonight, the National Knights of the Ku Klux Klan, it's headed by James Venable. Venable's a lawyer, and the land at the foot of state-owned Stone Mountain has been in the Venable family for years. A crowd of between three and 400 listen to Venable and others preach white supremacy and condemn the President and Congress of the United States. They have commonized and socialized and niggerized our great country. A little before 9 p.m., Venable interrupted the speech-making for the lighting of the crosses. From the foot of Stone Mountain, Don McClellan, Action News.